Hi guys, what's up? This is Shubhri from eGadgets for you. Now in this video, I'll show you how to upgrade to iOS 9 from any version of iOS 8. Now I have myself an iPhone 6 and an iPad Air 2. So I'll show in both the device simultaneously that how the upgrade should be done to iOS 9. If you take a very close look in the iPhone 6, you will see that under settings, we do have this notification number that shows that some notification is pending over there. But this particular thing is missing in the iPad. Whereas, nothing to worry, in both the scenarios, if I go to settings, then go to general, and under general, I, I will go to software update. Make sure you are connected to the internet. You will see that it prompts of the iOS 9. Similarly for the iPhone 6 over here, I go to settings, then go to general, software update. It will again prompt for the iOS 9. So, in both the scenarios, you can go ahead and see, learn more, what are the new things that you get in the new iOS. But, better to go ahead and download and install. Before doing so, I just want to make sure that your iPad or your iPhone is charged properly or else it will ask for charging in between. So I'm hitting download and install over here, so it asks for my passcode, I'll just give that. Okay, in the iPad, uh, the terms and conditions page has come, so I hit agree. Uh, it says that yeah, at the end of the day you have to hit agree or else it won't proceed. So now in the iPhone also, this particular terms and conditions page come, and I hit agree over here. So again, agree, and it has started in both the device. You just need to sit back and relax. I may crop the video in between, but this is the entire process. Whenever a new screen comes, I'll show you in the video. Okay, after waiting for some time, you can see that the status changed to downloading. And over here it says about 17 hours remaining. So nothing to worry, it's just a figure, but it will, uh, it, it will not take 17 hours in reality, but will complete much before that. The iPad has already started downloading the OS. Similarly, for in some time, maybe, the iPhone will also start downloading the iOS. So, you just need to see, sit back and relax. Nothing to do over here. As you can see, once the download has completed, the status changed to preparing update. So, you need to give this much particular time. So, the preparation for the update is done completely. So, now it's completely updated. It's asking me to plug in the charge over here. So, I've done that and let us go ahead. So, you see over here it says install now. I'll go ahead and click install now. It says verifying update. So you see the screen goes blank and it says verifying update. Nothing to worry over, over here. It's a simple procedure that is going on for the update to happen. Again, you see the Apple logo appears and a progress bar also comes over here. So you just need to sit back till this progress bar is fully completed and uploaded and updated. As you can see, the progress bar is nearing its end. So the process of update will soon start. Let us just wait for this particular thing to end. So once the progress bar removes, your iPad will restart again. So now, the final progress bar is appearing and the screen has become much more brighter. So just need to wait once this process is completed. So now the progress bar has ended. Okay, the first screen of Hello, it comes. So just need to give your passcode and see how it up it says update completed your iPad was updated successfully there were just a few more steps to continue till you have finished so just need to hit continue okay it's asking to enable the location service okay let me enable it for now later I can go to settings and again disable it okay let me just give my password for the iCloud okay I've given the password for the iCloud okay, it says updating the iCloud settings so give it some time let the full update of the iCloud completes okay it now asks me that whether I want to share the data with app analytics or something like that I prefer to not share it so it's up to you end of the day okay now it says welcome to iPad get started I hit on get started and now here is a new iOS 9 let me just go to general under settings in about you will see that the version it says 9.0 so I have successfully upgraded my Apple iPad Air 2 to iOS version 9 similarly in your iPhone also whether it's a iPhone 4s or 5, 5s, 6 in each and every Apple devices this particular method you just need to sit back relax follow the steps just hit on the next and stuff to that and you will successfully upgrade to iOS 9.0 maybe I'll make a separate video that will show the features and the settings of iOS 
Till then, remain subscribed to my YouTube channel. I'll catch you guys in my next video very very soon. That's it guys. Bye for now.